too. Uh, it was a freak accident. It was just a freak accident. A veteran of other alligator hunts, Karsten Kiefer, shared this photo of an 11 footer he and friends caught early last week. Never dreaming that while hunting Lake Jessup last Thursday, he'd end up in an alligator's jaws. Every now and then you get gators that are crazy. And uh, we happen to be in a very shallow part of the lake. Um, so he was able to get ground and actually launch himself out of the water. Uh, and doing that, he, he, I kind of lost balance and he came up far enough to where he could reach and bite and get a hold of my arm. Right arm, it's uh, below, the, below the elbow, partial amputation. That 911 call brought much needed help. Once I heard the crunching and I saw that my lower part of my arm just get, um, you know, pretty much amputated, uh, it, it, that kind of scared me, and uh, that's that's it. That's the end of uh, end of my life as I know it. Kiefer, a paramedic, says he was lucky he had another paramedic on board. My friend did you know everything to the book. You know he tore his belt off and made a tourniquet. It was terrifying in the moment. Uh, luckily, my buddy that was there uh, did everything right that he could possibly do. Kiefer said he underwent six hours of surgery right away and a follow-up procedure on Monday. Fish and Wildlife hired a trapper to remove the 12-foot gator. So far, it has not been captured.